Welcome back, noble viewers. Let's head back to the Normandy. All right, let's go speak with Shakwa. I'm glad they've decided to help the war effort. Everybody has to fight now, no matter how pretty you are. I do want to um, upgrade some stuff first, though. I always love the M35, Mako. It's got heart, you know. Ah, oh, come on! The M44 Hammerhead is vastly superior. Come. On. Uh, we want. We want I a couple so. things upgraded. The Black Widow. Like rhino. No agility whatsoever. More like a bull that can climb and climb for days. It only climbs because of its stupid, vertically aligned mass effect field. We'll just jump or stick. All right, so we got that totally upgraded. Movement. Hey, what is the it like that? Who needs to move? If you want that, why don't you just stick with the old M29 Grizzly? Hey, I love that tank. <laughs> You would be one to love grizzly bears, Mr. Vega. <laughs> what? Is that a gay joke? <laughs> nice. Want to just start upgrading our stuff here. Start dropping some cash into it. What the hell? We'll pump this dis uh, disciple up. Get the claymore up. Uh, faced and why not? Sure, you can. I mean, really, um. All right, that's enough spent on that. Let's go see Doctor Shakwa. Shakwa, Sha Shamaniqua. And then we're going after Tali. Nothing is stopping us at this point, folks. I am I am gung ho for Tali. Doctor. You always pull through, Commander. We've received the supplies from Tactus. Everything good? Indeed. We've acquired some very useful equipment. As such, I've been able to enhance the effectiveness of our Medijal delivery systems. I've also collated information that Liara may find of interest. Check with Glyph. God damn it! Alright, we just gotta check with Glyph, and then we're going after Tali. Promise. First Glyph, then Tali. Have we heard from Agent Detrace yet? She has not. A Prothean. A living, breathing Prothean right below me. He's... Uh, med bay he, uh, surgery. He was oh. a little cold when I tried to talk. I understand the shepherd waking up again. His species gone. But a Prothean shepherd? There's so much he could tell us. Take the health bonus. Uh, what is this? Store discount or power damage? Power damage, baby! Intact Reaper weapon. Weapon damage. Ammo Weapon damage, baby. I am the sniper. Nice. There is new information on the private messages terminal. God damn it. <laughs> Prothean notes. I'm not sure why I approach him while you're traveling, but he isn't very inclined to talk. Or is he a fundamental difference in our culture? The things this Prothean must have seen. Uh, I must give him time to get his bearings, but goddess, when will we get another chance to learn so much? From Jacob to Dr. Brand, I miss you, Brand, but I'm glad you're back there. The fighting's, uh, I've gotten a cold shoulder from people who know I used to work for Cerberus. Can't say I blame them, especially after what happened to the set at all. I love you, Brand. I was wondering on that problem you sent me last night, and I think I found a solution for synchronizing the crucible energy burst. All right. I mean, don't you just start to feel a part of something huge in this game? Like you're... It's that word that I... 
I, I love to use. And, and uh, you know, as, as some may talk to me, whatever, I, I, it's not a place to get into the bait of it. But uh, I, I'm not really a religious person, but I, I do believe very strongly in this idea of transcendence. This idea of, of being more than what you are, growing, growing beyond of what you are. We are so going here, Tali. We are on our way. This is long overdue. Do we just want to check around here? You know me, I mean... Not... Flying through the sun! Woohoo! Flying in the sun! Woohoo! Alright, here we go! Aquarian Envoy. Yes! Yes! Commander Shepard, a pleasure to see you again. Though I wish it were under better circumstances. You're not my Tali. I had hoped for your support in the fight against the Reapers. What's going on? Seventeen days ago, with precision strikes on four Geth systems, the Quarians initiated the war to retake our home world. Which was a clear violation of our agreement with the Council to avoid provoking the Geth. A treaty violation is nothing compared to recovering our homeworld and advanced AI technology. Your homeworld? You mean Rannoch? Correct, Commander. 300 years ago, we lost our world to our own AI creations, the Geth. After we attempted to kill them? We didn't try to kill them, Chorus. We tried to deactivate them. It wasn't murder. They became sentient. Oh, God, but I... I reprogrammed them. I, th I think I did in the past. They are machine. Oh, but so is Edie. Edie's just a machine. So how can I go against the rights of the Geth if I if I tell Edie I'd be too much of a hypocrite? At least at least this playthrough. No, it was murder. Commander. The Quarians never intended to create a true AI. It was an accident. It doesn't matter! Which you chose to correct by trying to kill them. Don't bother. Admitting we were wrong would undercut the justification for this suicidal invasion plan. You're throwing yourselves at the Geth? Again? And this time, we may have destroyed our people for good. We We'd driven the Geth back to their home system when this signal began broadcasting to all Geth ships. The Reapers. No, Under no. Reaper control, the Geth are significantly more effective. Our fleet is pinned in the home system. If we're going to win, we are... Win? You insisted on involving the civilian ships, Admiral Geralt. We need to retreat or we'll lose the live ships. Where's the signal coming from? Here. A Geth Dreadnought. It can outgun anything we've got, and it's heavily defended. The Normandy stealth drive can get us in undetected. I could board, then disable the Reaper command signal. Yes. Cutting off the signal should throw the Geth into complete disarray. And while they're confused, you get to a mass relay and retreat. Good. Our civilian ships have seen too much fighting already. Are you certain you can disable the signal? Where is we'll get you out Tali? of there safely, Admiral. Also, an old friend of yours, while <gasps> technically still exiled, has offered to help against the Geth. Yes! Shepard. Tally. Admirals, already a team to hit that dreadnought. Thank you, Commander. Yes. Tally's back! I had no idea you were with the fleet. They're keeping it quiet. There was a lot of publicity around my exile. But I'm an expert on the Geth, so... You're their dirty little secret. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. Why didn't you tell me? I would have helped. Thanks, but I knew you had your own problems. I'm sorry about Earth. We've got the largest fleet in the galaxy. If you can help us, we'll hit the Reapers with everything we've got. Or however much is left from this stupid war. I thought you'd support the invasion. No. After talking to Legion, I thought maybe there was a chance for peace. 
So why help them? They're still my people. Even if I am the Admiral's dirty little secret. And what about us? Am I your dirty little secret? <sighs> no! Their disapproval can't be any worse than being exiled. But right now, I've got civilian ships taking fire. Can we keep this quiet, at least in front of the Admirals? Sure thing, Miss Vas Normandy. Well, thank you. If you want to talk in private, maybe you could invite me up to your cabin? Yes. Maybe I could. Yes. <laughs> Sorry. Tali's been one of my... F For the oh. record, still totally worth it. <laughs> Come on! Can you watch that and not, not absolutely love Tali? She's ah, oh. such a cool character, Tali. Tali, I'm free if you'd like to come up. I'll just be a moment. Thanks for asking me up. I couldn't talk freely in front of Ron. You okay? No, no, I'm really not. Seventeen million lives are riding on me. And I don't know if I can save them. Hey. You're not alone. This was supposed to be my father's fight, but he left me with all of this. If they die because of me, if... if I don't... We'll get them out of there safely, Tally. And maybe it's better to just be in exile. At least this way I don't expect them to listen to me. That still has to hurt. It wasn't so bad when it happened. I had you. Do I still have you? Tally, nothing between us has changed. Unless you wanted to. Kila, Shepard. <laughs> I'm not going to beg, but I didn't come up here just to see the fish. Chicka bow! You came up here because I asked you to. <laughs> I want you here. With me. Okay. Oh, I love it. I love it. <laughs> I know, I'm like super nerd, I really am, but I don't know, that there, there's always just been this soft spot in my heart for Tali after Tally or whatever they're calling her in this. Uh, I don't know, Emmy too, I just, I, I really came to like the character. And then now, just Emmy 3, it's like, ah! Commander. Oh, now you're pissed at me, aren't you? Where are we going? Heading there. Check a bow. Come on, Tolly. Bam. What is all this stuff? Migrant fleet. All right, baby. Going in. We've got to... Come on, please let Tali be in my group, though. <gasps> yes, I can bring Tali! Uh, and, folks, I apologize. Tali will now be on every single mission with me. Um, that's just the way it is. I'll take James. Because Tali is awesome. What can I say? <laughs> I do want to change off to... The Black Widow 5. The damage is lower that... Maybe I can upgrade it enough, though, so that... What is this here? Uh, concentration mod is pretty nice. Extended Barrel 3 is 20% more damage. Damn. Oh, so I can either go through smoke or... Speed's perception. Yeah, I am going to take the extra perception. Now I've got 
that which is pretty solid. Um, shot. Tali's a oh, Tali's armed with a shotgun. Damn, I didn't know that. The claymore. Oh yeah, look, this thing is just gonna rip through stuff. High caliber, uh, caliber, caliber barrel. And accuracy. Oh yeah. Predator five. What is the? Yeah. All right. We'll put that on you. Accuracy by twenty percent. Damage by twenty percent. That really isn't that much damage, to be honest with you. But capacity would be huge on that. I didn't. I figured she was going to be armed with a submachine and a heavy pistol. I didn't think she was going to have a shotgun. All right, you. We are giving you. Uh, let's give you the the face and yes. That's good. Damage isn't all that high on it, but its capacity. You you should get a lot out of that. And the claymore, you're good with. All right. Six points. Um. Let's take the armor piercers. Squad mates can no, I'll take the straight up damage from for Shepard. James, we want your arms master up. Increase shield recharge, yeah. And health bonus and shield increase melee squad mates health and Wow Definitely take that. And we'll give you the incendiary ammo. Perfect. Tolly. Tolly Tolly. Uh, we're gonna want that. Let me see what else she's got. Energy drain. Steel barrier and shield power. That's pretty. Oof. Increase damage by thirty. Yeah, let's let's make you more on that sabotage. We'll give you a few of that combat drone. Oh yeah, those that was really cool. Um, drone stuns enemy. Drones damage. And we'll just make this a pure, a pure fighting little drone and defense drone. Ooh. Oh God. Well, fine. Increased duration. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, recharge speed up. Tech power up. Good. I'm so happy to have Tali. Ah! We're approaching the quarry and home system. ETA to Rannoch, five minutes. What have you got from the comm buoys? Pretty much a big old shitstorm, Commander. I have detected several hundred unique ship signatures engaged in active combat. Yeah, like I said. <laughs> Take us in, Joker. Shitstorm. Wait, wait. Stealth drive engaged. Only way they'll detect us is if you all start singing the Russian national anthem. Oh, Canada. That's not the Russian one, is it? Damn. I always get the Russian Oh my god! Where's my renegade action to punch him? Shepard, there's a problem. All teams except one are physically secured. I see the free one. Pretty torn up, though. Too risky for the whole team. I'll secure the docking area. Everyone else can follow me over. Roger that, Commander. We'll just stay here. You know, 
quietly. Hang tight. It'll just be a minute. All right, folks. I'm going to cut here. As always, thanks for watching. Tune in. Oh, can I not save? I can't save here. So we're going to keep going then. Uh... Oh, God, no. This is not the type of thing I should be doing after drinking. No wonder the Quarians were having trouble. That ship is enormous. It is 30% larger than an Alliance Dreadnought. Thanks, Edie. That, that was... Tally, you're gonna like the view. Better than a vid? <laughs> Much. Tali's the type of chick who, like, a perfect date night is just playing video games together. You know, that, that, that's, that's Tali. <laughs> Yeah, no kidding. Has artificial gravity. You should be okay once you're on board. Until then, I'll make do with mag boots. Hey, take your time, Commander. We're fine until they, you know, look out a window. Get yeah, don't use windows, remember? Structural weakness. But the cats are just sitting there saying those organics would never try the no windows thing twice. <laughs> Mag boots. Looks like the rest of the team isn't using the docking tube. So I'm guessing you'd rather not solo the dreadnought. Not if I can help it. Ask Tally to get on the dreadnought schematics. If she can point me at another docking tube, I'll override the controls and let the boarding party on. Right. I've got gravity again. Great. I'm looking for. Got it. There should be a hull breach not far from your position. The nearest undamaged docking tube is on the other side. Alright, folks, cutting here. As always, thanks for watching. Tune the next. Thanks for watching, folks.